Hi Capricorn, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I am here to do your singles reading. This is for Capricorn Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Now this is a message from my guides for you. This reading um, is not going to be like anybody else's. Mine never are. This is a message from my guides. Okay. So this is for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. There's no timeline on this reading. This is for singles. Whatever comes up, comes up. And you know, sometimes they're pretty and sometimes they're not. So let's see what we got. You're single. Let's see what we got. We're going to get one of these. And then, and then whatever's on the bottom, we're going to take that as well. So whether it falls out or I flip it. What do we get? Well, we got two of them here. So I think we're just going to take them both. We will look at the bottom one, too. Very soon, clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now. You have to choose. You have to decide. This indecision isn't serving you very well. It's not. If you need to decide what the hell you want. Wedding. This situation involves marriage. Now, this one was reversed. Do you want a partnership? Do you want a divorce? What the hell do you want? This situation involves marriage. Do you want a commitment? Are you ready to give up the last one? I mean, this could mean so many things. You have to make a decision, Capricorn. What do you want? Do you want love? Or not? We're going we're gonna to put that one away and I'm going to get the one on the bottom, like I said. Romantic feelings. Your feelings are real and worth exploring. Your feelings are real. Don't let your fears get in the way. True love. This is the romance of a lifetime. You have an opportunity for true love. But you need to decide. You need to decide. You need to choose. <laughs> To follow your heart. Some of you are holding on to something. You may be holding on to somebody, you know, that you were married to. Maybe you were. Maybe you are. Maybe it's time to, you know, explore. What do we got, Capricorn? What do we have for Capricorn? Singles. Defense. Defending yourself, protecting yourself. You may be in defense mode. You may be ready to fight, right? You may be in fight mode. You may have a lot of people against you. You may feel like the world is against you. You don't have to engage. Turn your back and go your own way. Just walk away. Walk away from the fight. Walk away from the people that don't support you. Oh my God, something is coming to an end or there's been a death, right? This is the end. This is a death. This is a release. This is a major change. This is a transformation. This is an ending that bring that allows you to start over. But you you have your guard up, right? You're, you're in protection mode. You probably don't trust anybody. Nobody. Here we have this new beginning. Something it has ended or it... Well, obviously, this is for singles. This is a release. It's a major life change. And you probably think about going back. You probably keep thinking about going back. You know, how can, you know, I wish I could go back. I wish I could go back. I wish I could go back and change how things were. I wish I could have done things differently, right? You're having regrets. It's time to release those regrets. This is an opportunity to start fresh. But we got somebody here who keeps thinking about what they could have done. You know, what could have I done better? You know, I wish I would have made better choices, blah, 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 blah. Anyway, you have to make, this is make that clear decision. This is make that clear decision. This is clearly decide and this is clearly decide. Make that decision to release. I think that there's, there, there's, for some of you, there's a divorce. There's the end of a commitment. 
There's no reciprocation. There's no equal give and take. You were probably dealing with somebody that didn't give to you, somebody that didn't reciprocate, somebody that fought with you all the time. You know, they may have blocked you or blocked communication. They have blocked your um, ability to see things clearly. They probably made you very confused. They probably had other options and you maybe you refused to see it. You may have not listened. You know, you didn't want to listen. You didn't want to believe it. This is disbelief. I feel as though um, you can no longer give to something that has ended. It's time to stop giving it your energy. You have a big opportunity waiting for you. This is a gift from God, okay? This is a gift from God. That's the hand of God saying, here you go. I got something for you. Do you want it or do you want to throw it away? What do you want, Capricorn? You want, you want this golden opportunity? You want to throw it away? Some of you need to stop giving to a dead end. Clearly decide what you want. So that you can, this is a, you have something golden waiting for you, but you keep giving your energy and fighting with somebody who uh, has probably walked away. Or you keep thinking about what happened, which is, which, and you keep giving it your energy. You keep, that's what we got here. You keep giving something your energy that has already ended. When it is really time for you to, you know, you, you matter. Anyway, wish fulfillment. Oh my God. This is, this is a time of inspiration. It's a time of hope. It's a time of renewal. It's a time of healing. It's a time to live again. It's, you know, this is universal protection. The universe is protecting you from something that was an illusion. It wasn't real. There's a lack of passion. There was a lack of growth. There was a lack of reciprocation. They were protecting you from something that wasn't meant to be. And this is... An opportunity to, this is a wish being granted. This is an opportunity for wish fulfillment. You have a golden opportunity here that could help you. This, this opportunity could bring you something very bright. This is a, you know, this is bright. This is a star. It shines very brightly. This, this is, this is an opportunity for you to shine This is an opportunity for you to live a whole new life, to start a whole new life. But you can't keep giving your energy to some sort of dead end that you keep thinking about and you keep communicating with or whatever. You need to block communication for real. Because every time you give the you give the this other person energy, the universe sees that you are not allowing yourself to heal. Oh boy, this is the end of a relationship. Ten of Cups reversed. This is like a dying dream. And I feel like you guys are still holding on to that loss. But the, the universe, or God, has has caused this, or allowed this, or... ended something okay in your life because they have they were trying to protect you because you have a bigger more beautiful opportunity here that could really 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 be a dream come true your dreams are bigger than whatever this dead end is that you can't seem to completely walk away from you know what I'm saying so singles I feel as though right now 
the God or the universe has this opportunity that they are dangling in front of you. It's like they gave, they got this opportunity for you and it's, a, and you might be even see it. It's a big opportunity. This is something that you can touch. It's something you can hold on to. It's something that you can save. It's, it's, uh, it's a gift. This is, this is both. This is a gift. They, it's like they have this gift for you, but you're blocking you're blocking it. You need to decide, clearly decide, that you are not going to go back to the dead end where there's no reciprocation, there's no equal give and take, there's no relationship. You need to clearly decide to not go back because you have a new beginning here something solid something stable i feel like you you're this week you are going to be given some sort of you're going to see this gift okay you're going to see this gift you're going to see the gift of all of this why how this happened why this happened you're going to see the reason okay you're going to see the reason this happened um you're going to be given something this week. You're going to be given something or you're going to see something. Um, this is going to make you happy. It is going to make you happy. It's going to help you. Um, oh my God, this is fortune. It's good fortune. It's the wheel of fate. You are, this is, you're going to be given something. You're going to, this could be good fortune. This is good fortune. You're going to be given something this week that is going to change your, your direction. This is destiny. It's meant to be. This this change that you, this release that has happened, this death that has happened or whatever it is, this ending that has happened is going to bring you something. It all happened for a reason. It all happened for a purpose. It's going to bring you something fortunate. Consider this like a fortunate accident. Like that would be serendipity, right? So this is fortunate. It is fortunate. You are about to receive something that is very fortunate that you you probably didn't even see coming. Um, this is a lucky break. This is good luck. This is meant to be. This, this death, this ending, was meant to be. Because you have something so big that they are going to give you. It is going to, it's going to be a dream come true, believe it or not. But you have to decide to not keep looking back. This is the wheel of change. Your life is about to change in a very positive, positive way. So be prepared. You're going to receive something that you can actually put in the bank, you know, in your bank. Doesn't have to be money, but I think it is. Could be money. It, well, it, obviously, I just said that could be because fortune. This is and this is fortune. Could be money. It could be um, whatever this is. You can touch it. This could be help. This could be universal help. Somebody from the somebody that has passed away. Somebody that has passed away may be helping you. Helping you to change your direction. So yeah, we have a completion here and I feel as though you're going to be surprised. I think you're going to be very surprised. I feel like you, the, the God, that I consider this God, ha, and this too, this hand of God, has something for you that is going to change your direction in a very positive, positive way. So expect to receive something that you didn't see coming. I don't know what it is. Um, that's what I got. That's what I got. You could, you could, you could have, this could be a new partner. Whatever it is, it's something that you that could last. It's something that is going to help you to feel stable and secure. Good luck.